Right, hello lads. So, yeah, when we left off, uh, things weren't going too well on, on this. So basically what we're going to do is going to just do a quick update. What's going to be going on with this save? What am I going to be doing? Um, and yeah, that's basically what we're going to be going over today. And at the moment, I don't know what to do. That's my problem. You know, I, I think I came into this and it was like, this is, this is meant to be with uh with Dagon and Roperich. that was that was what we were doing from the start and now I don't really know where to go because there's nothing available really the same level I'm looking for um so I don't know what to do it is it is a shame um it is annoying that we couldn't get to where we would have liked to have been, uh, but I think I'm gonna look for another something else in the uh, in the national league. Maybe maybe try and pick up a team that is also failing. Sorry, that's me. <laughs> As I say, I'm looking at Woking, but maybe I'll try and pick up Woking. Maybe I'll try and work my way back to the Dagenham Redbridge job. Um, because for now, yeah, we're not getting that job back, but I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to, uh, I'm going to take another job somewhere and I'm thinking as Woking and Harrogate both have insecure jobs, I'm thinking of taking one of them. I'm probably going to go with the Harrogate job, uh, because, uh, I think that's a better way to work up back towards Dagenham and Redbridge when I get the chance. So we are going to loop back to this if possible. And we're going to be forever keeping an eye on if Dagenham and Redbridge uh, have the job offer going on. And if they do, we're going to go for it. But for now, I think we're going to, I think the best idea for now is to take, uh, is to take another job at a different team. And I mean, if we go here, we look at the insecure jobs down in the uh in the national league it's harrogate and woking because you go up to like the carlisle they're in league two so it's uh so it's you know it's too high you go up to somewhere like you know this well they're in a completely different country in a completely different uh setup and then you go like portsmouth in league one so you can go all the way up to Bologna who are in Serie A is not going to happen so I think I'm going to I'm going to try and find find a way to uh, get into this job because we know this job is insecure not available yet but I think we're going to try and seek out hopefully that Woking or Harrogate job becomes available if either of them do become available I think I'm just going to go for the first one But I think, I think it's a good shout. Okay, I'm gonna declare interest in both. So we'll see. Maybe one of them is gonna uh, is gonna say, "Hey." We want to bring you in and if they do uh harrogate or woking i'm gonna take the job and we're gonna see what we can do with the team hopefully we can build it up and <laughs> i'd love to come up against dagenham and, and, and beat them how poetic justice that would be but this is now no longer going to be a dagenham and redbridge career mode it's gonna be just a football manager career mode with whoever whoever i uh Whoever I can get in with. So I don't know what I'm going to do about the titling and thumbnailing of the videos. That's the one thing I'm struggling with at the moment. Uh, but I'll figure out something. So I think, yeah, we're going to see what we can do. I mean, maybe nothing will come available, but I just wanted to make a quick little video to update you saying I've taken some time to think about it. And I figured out what I'm what I'm gonna do. And hopefully, hopefully we can work our way back to Dagon from Refrigeration.
bring them up to be a huge team. Paul Pogba just signed a new deal at United. There you go. Uh, that's something interesting, but yeah, seeing as we did did lose that job, which is not exactly what we want. Um, I'm going to try and work my way back to it. So, hopefully, hopefully one day we'll get back there. I'm just going to keep trying and trying, basically. Okay, Yo will also have an opening. That's what we want. Surely Harrogate, anyone in the National League has got an opening. Uh, I'm just going to declare interest. We just declare interest in all National League jobs going. Maybe just maybe one of them's gonna gonna come in and say, "Hey, let's have a chat. Let, we might want to get you in." Hopefully, hopefully. I don't want to. Available jobs at the moment is yeah, all way too high. Like Sheffield job, the Ipswich job, the MK Dons job, or the Sun Etienne job, way way too high level. We're working a National League level, and that's just how it is. All right, the Yeovil Town job has become available. They're a National League team. The available job. Are there any other National League jobs available? No, it's just this one. Well, let's just apply. The worst they can do is say no. Because this might become the Yeovil instead of Dagenham and Redbridge. Anyone else in the National League? Just Chorley and Harrogate, which I've already declared interest in. So if we do get the Yeovil job, we're going to do that in the next episode. We'll start our journey with a new team soon. Um. At the moment, not much is happening. We've got nothing in our inbox. Which is worrying me. I'm ho I was hoping that something would come through. But uh, for now, nothing. How are Dagenham doing? Oof, still, still low. Um, yeah, we want to get back to Dagenham. That's the dream. We've set by Harrogate. That means the Harrogate job is available. Uh, so we are going to just apply to that one. I'm also going to send another one that's through. Okay, we're not going to do that. Um, there's a Harrogate Town one. But have I lost it? Where is it? Oh, it's just there. Harrogate. Um, okay, I guess. I guess I can't send an application through to it. That's annoying. Why can't I send an application through? Because it just says apply all. I don't want to apply to every single job on this list. Just the Harrogate Town one. How do I, uh... Very interesting job. There we go. Yeah, I'm just going to say the most positive thing I can when the media approached me. 
because then it's more likely I'm going to get the job. Maybe. I don't know if that's how this works. I don't know what it's like to be fired in Football Manager because I've not been playing Football Manager long, and so I haven't experienced it. Simply because I haven't been playing for a long time. This is not some, like, ooh, I don't know it because I'm just so good. No. This is, uh, I've not been playing the game long enough to know. Hartlepool, they are also National League. Where are you at, Hartlepool? Alright. I will declare my interest in the job. I'm just going to, like, every National League job that comes through, I'm just going to go all out for it, and hopefully... Okay, so Yeovil didn't want me. Okay. That's fine. We've got multiple other options that are coming through, which are going to... Hartlepool fans laugh it off. Okay. Fine, they've just been a bit rude from the Hartlepool fans, but... It's fine, I'm not hurt. Can I maybe even look to, like, a National League North job? Maybe? Congratulations to Man United's under-23s for winning the league. Thing is... Available jobs, there's nothing that go in the English leagues, it goes below. It goes below National League. So it's like, yeah. There isn't youth. I want to stay in senior management, not youth management. And that's the problem. May as well just apply for it. No reason not to at this point, eh? Sully Hill Moors didn't want us. Where are you not Sully Hill Moors? Ninth. Okay, they're pretty high up in the table. Well, this is not what I was hoping for, I'm not going to lie. Yep, that's not what I wanted. Okay. There's, I mean, there's a small chance. It's oh no, it's never gonna happen. It's never gonna actually happen. Okay, heart the full of a new manager. Damn it! Why does no one wanna hire me? All I did was do shit for months on end. Is um, the Harrogate of a new manager, heart the full of a new manager. Why can't I apply to this? Right. 
the fold. Fans are gonna laugh off it. Yep, yep. Yeah, Dagno and Roperish fans will laugh it off. You know what to remind me I've been unemployed for a while. Okay, listen. Shush. No need for that. But I'm not gonna lie lads, I think it's looking a little bit bleak at the moment. Um, oops. All right, well, I'm sending in everything I can. Oh my god, I missed a Honduras under-23s versus Canada under-23s game. Oh, a one-all draw between them. What a game. Dagger and Ropebridge fell down. That's pain. That is pain. That's that's a shame. That being said, it proves that it wasn't just me because their new manager easily had enough games to pull them out of the relegation zone. If he was actually good and it wasn't just the players being shit. So in a weird way, it's almost nice to see them get relegated. because it means that it wasn't my fault. What it implies is that they just, the players just weren't there. Tottenham avoid relegation. Well, if Tottenham finished sixth, what do you mean avoid relegation? They were sixth. I'm so confused why they said, oh, Tottenham just avoided relegation. Like, yeah, mate, they're in sixth place. No wonder they fucking avoided relegation when they were sixth. Hello? File off a job interview. Attend the interview.
I actually might do this, you know? We might get the job. And we have a second interview, let's go! We might have two opportunities here. We have some options here. We might we might find something new. Is it the Dagenham job? No. Would I much rather it be the Dagenham job? Yes. But I'm doing what I can here. Got the best thing going that I can. Uh, those two jobs are higher level than we're currently operating at, so we're just going to ignore them. But, uh, we'll see. We'll see how this goes. We might get something. Lincoln. Things are Lincoln. They're a League One side, and I just... So far, I didn't want to. I'm going to attend it. Uh, I might say no. If they offer it to me, I might say no because I don't want to make a huge jump up. Because I don't want to move from Dagenham Road Bridge all the way up to Lincoln because that could just be a jump too far. And I'm going to just do the same thing with this Fleetwood one. keep doing this but I think if I do get offered Fleetwood or, or Lincoln I'm most likely going to turn it down because of just the stark difference uh, in in stature between the jobs of Dagenham and then up to them I prefer to work in my own level obviously like most actual managers wouldn't do this but for the sake of uh, consistency in the series I think it might be that way We'll see. It's very likely I don't even get offered either either of these jobs in the, in the end of the day. You know, it's it's yeah, exactly. Fleetwood job unsuccessful. Sure, that's fine. And I expect it even in the next couple of days to be like, oh yeah, the Lincoln job was unsuccessful, and that's fine. But it's worth going for these things. Yeah, exactly what I was expecting. That's fine.
So yeah, I think I just gotta wait now. But it's a shame. I'd like to be doing something bigger and better than what I'm doing now. Than just sitting here with nothing. Right and avoid relegation by being in 13th. <laughs> I don't understand this game. Also, Arsenal in third. Like, come on, be realistic. Yeah, this game just needs. Sometimes the realism of this game is is a uh, pretty off. Arsenal in third. Like, come on, mate. Arsenal. They're not going to finish third. But, um, oh, so United are in the, uh, in the final of the FA Cup. Oh, nice. No, so United have officially qualified for uh, Europa, at least. But yeah, I think... Uh, I think I might just carry on with stuff like this in my own free time, because currently you're just seeing me click next a bunch of times, and it's not that entertaining. Um, yeah, I don't really know where I'm going to go from here. I was kind of hoping something would materialise in uh in this in uh in this time frame but clearly nothing uh Newcastle relegated Chelsea do the double and Newcastle get relegated so that's it your top four of the champions in the Premier League this season, Chelsea, City, Liverpool, United, with Arsenal and Tottenham below. And then you relegate teams Newcastle, Crystal Palace, Sheffield. Oof. Brighton having a decent season in 13th. Southampton having a very Southampton season in 14th. It's very Southampton, you know? I actually kind of like Southampton. But yeah, I uh, I think that's gonna be. I think we're gonna say that that's everything for today because nothing's happening here. It's a shame. I'd have liked something more to have come through from this, but unfortunately, unfortunately, nothing has materialized. Marcus got 23 goals in a season. That is unbelievable. Hey, United won the FA Cup. A 3-2 win over Leicester. With Odie and Igalo and Paul Pogba on the score sheets. Odie and Igalo scoring twice. So there you go.
Man United started playing Andreas Pereira and Scott McTominay and brought on Fred and le and still won 3-2. Wow. Starting Brandon Williams as well. Man United started Odia Nigalo, Andreas Pereira, Scott McTominay brought on Fred and still won. That is spectacular. And Leicester just took off Tielemans for Pratt. For Pratt? I don't know how this guy's name is said. Pratt? Pratt? I don't know, but this dude, he's like a he's a well known player, so not to say his name properly. Uh oosh, Michael having a terrible day. But it does look like United deserved it off the off the stats. Congratulations to United for winning the FA Cup. And anyway, yeah, that is gonna be everything from me today. So uh unfortunately we couldn't get more today, but maybe something more will come at some point. Hopefully. But that's going to be everything, so thank you very much for watching, I'll catch you later.